Let's take a look at the fourth platform preview of IE10 running on the Windows 8 Developer Preview, with more support for HTML5 technology to enable richer web applications with improved performance. IE10 adds support for cross-origin resource sharing, or CORES, for safely sharing and moving data across domains using XML HTTP requests. This demo uses CORES along with file API, drag drop support, and an HTML5 progress control styled with CSS for fast and fluid experience uploading multiple files. The web app is running on one domain, and the files are uploaded to another domain for storage. You can drag files from the local machine and drop them to upload and see visual feedback indicating the progress. Let's look at an example of improved performance in this platform preview. This demo brings together HTML5 canvas, gradients, and opacity with SVG rendering and touch interaction. Here, each falling raindrop is a separate div tag animated with CSS3 transforms. The improved layout performance and hardware acceleration in IE10 enables fast rendering and a steady 60 frames per second. Let's look at this demo in another browser. Here, in the latest version of Chrome, you have the same demo running the same markup, but you're only getting around three or four frames per second of rendering performance. Next, let's look at new CSS support for controlling end user selection. With CSS user select, developers can control precisely which parts of their app can be selected. Without user select, all parts of the page can be selected by the user. Developers can specify user select and CSS rules to control the selection. Here, only text in the edit box can be selected. This improves the experience by keeping app UI separate from the content. Let's look at one more demo. Making web content accessible to all consumers is important. IE10 adds new support for text captions with HTML5 video. In this demo, you can see how IE10 support for the HTML5 track element enables rendering text captions that are synchronized with the contents of the video. Because caption files are just text and timestamps, you can search the captions and even click to jump to a specific point in the video. IE10 is the first browser with track captioning and support for TTML and WebVTT formats. Developers can choose which format works best for their needs. With this latest platform preview, IE10 continues to deliver the foundational features and performance developers depend on to build great applications. You can download the latest IE10 platform preview for Windows 8 today and try these demos and more at ietestdrive.com.